see see no evil grayson wrestles with america is a christian nation and white and islam is a brown religion in the other i'm paraphrasing his thoughts i believe he's talking to you bobby here bobby can you talk about your experience with race ethnicity nationality now that you are a muslim okay i can but first off is that something that you wrestle with do you see islam as a brown religion or well i mean when i go to a masjid and i look around and everyone you know i'm in a white town everyone is sure everyone appears to be white here but then when you mm. walk into them when i walk into the masjid i'm like it, it looks i've never been to the middle east but it looks like i'm in the middle east you know right right so i mean part of me is like a little bit fearful like whoa am i you know am i leaving my people in a sense sure. you know like understand that's racist or whatever anyone could say but yeah you're naturally gonna feel like now i'm the like i can just sense people's eyes being like i'm you know as you probably can sense it too like you stand out just like if i would when i was traveling in vietnam like you stand out i walk into the coffee shop sure. it's like oh a white guy's here so yeah i mean i know that's just completely emotion but it, it is something that's on my mind every time i walk oh i understand i mean racism is something that has been defined fairly recent as well so i think 150 years ago there was no such word as racism i believe but anyways so race and kinship to your people is natural and normal as well it is normal that we want to belong to our group of people that's just what it is yeah you don't want to be imagine <laughs> yeah, yeah it's understandable of course and i do think that it's very very hard in america especially in your town if the majority of pretty much everybody is not from your people of course it makes it harder for sure i totally get that but in terms of islam being a brown religion i mean for me islam if anything would be a very asian religion because i'm just surrounded by thais all the time they're muslim but of course that is not true it is the minority of muslims that are arab i think it was 17 percent or something like that i'm making all kinds of numbers up today Se oh my god seven. let me let me google this let me fact check it i've, I've heard that yeah it's it, very it little. Been, i wish i would have went to a, a mosque when i was in bangkok that would have it's been amazing. so early for me but it, it's just nice to see to basically ease my peace of mind that this isn't like an arab religion like, if you went to a you know, I see yeah. Africans who have migrated here, who I meet at, at mosques. I'm like, okay, like it just kind of like eases my worries that I'm becoming an Arab, <laughs> essentially, which I know is, oh, I mean, it's not ridiculous because you I'm used to, but it's, it's funny too, because then you think about Christianity, like you said, how Jesus was from modern day Palestine. Like, Palestine, yeah. well, that's as Middle Eastern as you could get right there. But why yeah. is it that we don't see Christianity that way? It makes no sense. You know why? My firm belief is that, obviously as a Muslim, that Jesus was a Muslim and he preached monotheism in the Middle East. However, then that religion has been watered down and whitewashed by the Roman Empire, and we know that this is true, through the various councils and ultimately with the Council of Nicaea where they established the Trinity and they make it into a Roman religion and they whitewash the whole thing, right? And so this is what we have nowadays. So we still have Islam within Christianity somewhere where he submits his will to the Father, right? Yeah. But it is masqueraded ultimately as a European religion. So they infuse the European Roman paganism into Islam and this is what is seen as Christianity because the followers of Jesus didn't call themselves Christians either. There was no such word. Yeah. Yeah. If you enjoyed the video, leave me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, check out the links in the description box below to further support my work. Thank you so much for your ongoing support, guys, and as always, may God bless you all. Much love and peace. <laughs>